Hello and welcome to the Blue Room Live blog. This is a live forum where 25 Perth theatre artists have been invited to share their view on live arts and theatre in Perth. Tonight's blogger is Melanie Brewer. Hi there, um, I'm actually from uh, the Perth Burlesque Company, Sugar Blue Burlesque. Uh, those who you don't know uh, Burlesque in Perth, we're basically the only company doing it in Perth. Uh, we started about two years ago. So just to give you a little bit of a background about us, um, I, myself and my business partner Sharon Davies uh, started the company uh, two years ago, as I said. Uh, we started, um, we actually met as swing dancers, so we both uh, da do vintage jazz dance like Charleston and Lindy Hop. And I myself as is a costumier by trade, so I love uh, vintage style, I love uh, doing costumes for theatre and have worked in theatre in Perth. Uh, for several years. Um, I worked with Matt Lutton, I also worked uh, with Brian Walcham and, um, and various different types of uh, productions. So um, I have got a good understanding about theatre in Perth and live performance and also about dance as well. Um, my business partner Sharon actually uh, started doing um, a lot of research about the history of burlesque and also the history about vintage styling. Um, she was very interested in that sort of uh, aspect of things because she was into graphic design and also a, a lot about um, web design. So together we had a big passion for it, we saw our first show together and then went, wow, this is fantastic, we love the glamour of it, we love the dance, we love the comedy aspect of it and we thought this would be a fantastic thing to start in Perth because there was nothing happening here at all. Uh, so, when we first started, we decided to put up a website, as you do, and uh, we then got a little bit of work doing private functions, uh, doing a bit of fan dancing with ostrich feather fans, um, very glamorous, beautiful, um, and then it became quite popular and uh, people demanded to, to learn how to do it, so we thought, okay, with our background in teaching um, dance, uh, through you know, our vintage jazz dance, we actually started uh, classes in Perth. Um, from there, they became very, very popular. Um, one of the main reasons I think they became so popular, um, especially with women, because it was women doing the classes, um, is because it created a sense of empowerment for women. Um, they felt sexy when they finished these courses. They were able to perform if they liked to. Um, they felt, I guess, uh, they felt like they could uh, be themselves and be happy within their own bodies. And that, I guess, is a very uh, big part of neo-burlesque and for women doing it. Um, so, in, in this regard, these classes have actually become uh, the main uh, point of focus about the burlesque scene in Perth. Um, from here, we were able to develop um, a mini, mini scene uh, for both men and women to come and see burlesque at different shows. Um, it went on to us doing lots of different types of shows. Um, so that was uh, the first year was, I guess, the class was starting. The second year, which was last year, we actually started uh, doing quite a lot of shows and we did a series of shows at the bakery um, through uh, the help of RH, um, who were fantastic. And uh, we did a series of sh one show a month called Back to Burlesque and we also did other shows, um, uh, graduation shows for our students as well and our advanced students. Uh, from these shows they've become very, very, very popular. We did about 20 shows last year. So we've done quite a lot of uh, performances in Perth um, and that's just our own shows. Um, they were mainly all directed by myself um, and we've done all the costumes ourselves. Um, they were very much, uh, it's, it's, it's an amazing thing to see these shows and there's a lot of comedy, there's dance, um, there's circus performers, um, we have singers, musicians, um, fantastic MCs, so we have actors as well uh, and it is a, a really interesting and impressive show to see. Um, from that, uh, there's a big point to be made about this live blog because a lot of it's got to do with a live performance in Perth but also, you know, the funding aspect of things. Um, because we're so popular and the, the art has become a revival in Perth as such because burlesque is an old art form, you know, it was back in the 1800s when it started so it is a very old art form but it is a very new thing to Perth in regards to the neo-burlesque scene. Um, we don't ever have ever had the funding Okay, this is a very big point and we have never even tried to get funding and we haven't had to try and get funding. So we're very lucky in that regards. I've never had to go through the bureaucracy that has been mentioned <laughs> in the past vlogs, um, which I've been very lucky about. Um, the shows fund themselves. Uh, if we have fantastic costumes that we make our own, the uh, performers, I have sometimes up to 16 to 18 uh, cast plus crew. 
in our shows. So they are quite a big uh, show. They go run for at least two hours. Um, and um, yeah, they're unfunded by the uh, government, <laughs> which is nice. <laughs> um, now the main thing about this is that, yes, we're able to fund our own shows. Yes, we may not have big, massive, fantastic sets that maybe other production or other theatre companies are able to have. But we'll go back to the grassroots of Burlesque where it was a little bit more gritty at times and um, you know it has that feel of a bit underground and I like that and I want to keep that going I guess. Maybe one day we'll have a fantastic spectacular set but I think the audience will be a different audience then. Um, so to keep that in Perth is really important to, for myself and for the troupe as well. Um, we've now become quite a, a big troupe. I now, from three girls starting um, two years ago, we are now over 30. Okay? I have about 30 cast and crew and people who help out. We have just um, have our, uh, launched our own venue in Perth called the Burlesque Lounge, which is really exciting on William Street. Uh, and this is providing a really fantastic forum for people to come and enjoy and uh, take part of being part of the burlesque scene in Perth, which is really super exciting. So I guess um, the main thing about being in Perth as such, it has really enabled us to uh, develop the art because of its isolation. Um, and this is a really important part, is that because it's isolated, there was a niche. And from that niche, people have just gone, wow, this is a bit different, oh, I haven't seen this before, it's because they haven't been out and been able to see it anywhere else, so we've been quite lucky in that regard, and it's become a fantastic art form in Perth, so thank you very much, I hope you come and see one of our shows. Okay.